And welcome back to another episode of the Grappling Dads Podcast. Yep. Yep, I did it again. <laughs> Man, that didn't even let me start. No, no. It's well, my go-to move. Well, I was I was going to start a different way, but yet again, no sponsors. Yeah, you <laughs> none, none to speak Insert of. Insert your sponsorship here. You know who I want to be sponsored by? Stem cell therapy. <laughs> a- any, anybody that does that, just, just jack me full of that stuff. I don't think that's a really big sponsor. It should be. I mean- is it legal? I mean, who who is better? Is it legal? <laughs> it is legal. Where? Everywhere? Germany. Okay, see. No, it's actually illegal here. It's just not FDA approved. You have to go under a uh, uh, test. Yeah, you got to- What? Gotta, yeah, well, uh, <laughs> the people that are trying to make it FDA approved- Trial? Tri- thank you. Test? It's the same thing as a trial, isn't it? No. It's just the wrong word. <laughs> no, it's not <laughs> all the way around. Uh, double blind placebo study? Like, what do you want me to tell you? It's, it's a thing. It's a thing. Trial test. Same Tri- thing. Yeah, trial. Yeah. So, yeah, so there's there's a lot more paperwork to it. So it's like, uh, from what I've heard, three to $10,000 per shot. Oh, we got that. Considering I need a shot in like both shoulders, <laughs> both knees. <laughs> do they I, have a body shot? Elbows and neck wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Dude, your neck could use a couple shots of uh, Oh, my stem cells. neck's so flipping stupid. You know what? They have uh, PRP. Have you heard of that? PRP? Platelet-rich plasma therapy. So they, they suck your blood out like vampires, as they do, and they spin it. And apparently they get certain platelets from your blood that they inject. Inject. <laughs> <laughs> inject it. <laughs> inject it. Back into your sore spot in... So blood helps you heal, uh, heal. So blood flow makes you heal. So if you get certain kind of stuff from the blood and you put that all in the sore spot, it makes it heal faster, allegedly. Yeah, that sounds stupid. It does sound stupid. And it also sounds like I have to give blood and I'll pass out. It sounds like I'm desperate and I'll try anything at this point. Yes. But I can't afford it. So if you want to sponsor the show and you do PRP, hit me up. Don't hit me up. <laughs> I'll just pass the hell out. Will not be worth. I'll get a whole new injury from falling on the ground. I'll be your like free trial. That'll be awesome. <laughs> so weird. To be fair, I'm actually doing a lot better injury wise. It's starting to heal up. I am like, not. No, no, you're still fucked. But my uh, my range of motion gone, and it's still um, twingy and tweaky, if you will. But it's not injured. Like I'm not just screwed up as I have been. My you finger, sure about that? Well, my fingers hurt all the time. Like making a fist kind of sucks. My grip strength is kind of waning, but uh, doesn't seem like it. No, no. I've, well, no. I, I, I can't get your damn hand off. Oh, I give her hell, but uh, <laughs> it just hurts when I do so. Then why do you do that when you're rolling with me? I want to win. No, you don't. You're my you're my friend, and I can't let you beat me. It's probably it. I'm that guy. I think it is. I'm that guy. You are that just guy. With you though. Everybody else. Eh, it's fun. You, I must win at all costs. <laughs> well, I wish you were kidding, but you're not. Uh, no, I'm not kidding. That sucks for me because you're way better than me. It sucks for Kip. We were we were doing uh, get out of bad positions, and you and I were each other's partner. Yeah, that wasn't good for me. And it was really funny when I got your back and you tried to rip my grip off. I'm like, and it just stayed there. Like, one, no, <laughs> don't don't bother with that. But two, it's really fun watching you try. I thought. <laughs> I, d- I don't let people take my back very often. Like, as soon as I really don't turtle very long, I just immediately spin around. Yeah. Like, I won't get to a lot better position, but I don't have people take my back a lot. Yeah. I should train with it more, well. but... I just have them hop on your back from now on. Like, yeah. that's just how you start. Hop on. You're an asshole. Get your hooks in. It'll be fun. Actually, I wouldn't mind that. it Because I got to get better at it. Yeah, absolutely. And you're a dick. Uh, yes. And I was way off that day. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know what the hell my problem was. I was fine at rolling. Like, my second roll in, I was like, oh, I'm not a moron. <laughs> hey, hey, it'll all be better now because you have an injury sock now, thanks to Nicole. Oh, my gosh, that thing's wonderful. Who is not here? And I'm kind of butthurt that she's with your wife and not being producer Nicole. I'm sad. She does. She needs to be here. I had a good story for her to read, and now that she's not here, I can't I can't read the story. Well, there goes the show. I know. Should we just end it now? Oh, we could. Fuck it. I'm not sure what else to talk about, because <laughs> it was really funny. <laughs> Is this the one you told me I needed to hear? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you got you to hear it on the podcast by her lips. Yeah, the, the banana story, banana bread story worked out well that way, so we'll, go yeah, yeah. we'll stick with it. Yeah, the, the author of said story said it's hard to drive and cry laughing at the same time. So, <laughs> Dude, that's what... I said, but it's okay if you text at the same time as you're driving. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Nick. Knock that shit off. My wife does that shit a lot. Don't throw your wife under the bus. Tens of people are going to hear about that. I don't even think that many. 
No, ones. Ones of people. Ones of people. Uh, Croyler listens. Yes. And he enjoyed the banana bread story. <laughs> <laughs> so if you yeah. haven't heard the banana bread story, find it. I'm not going to tell you which episode it's on. Just listen you just to have them all. to listen to all of them. Until you run across it. <laughs> so we had a couple uh, couple subjects we wanted to talk about tonight on our on our solo podcast. Uh, one was the slam video that's been oh. going on. Oh, and if you follow us on Facebook, you would have seen Dude, it. Dude, check. Well, if you follow anything jiu-jitsu related on yeah, Facebook, it was you're going to see it. Was but it was on Jiu-Jitsu Times. Yeah, that's yeah. Like, that's where I ripped it from. Or yep. share, or shared, shared it from. Shared it from. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say stole it. <laughs> I like stole it way better. <laughs> yeah, Jiu-Jitsu Times is way bigger than us, and they get all the good articles. I'm like, I'll just yeah. click on their page, and, and I'm going to talk mine. about yeah, I'm going to talk about your stuff now. <laughs> Thank you, Jiu-Jitsu Times. You're awesome. Thanks. Thanks for the fodder. Yes, I said fodder. I said fodder. More old words from Paul. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, with the, with the uh, with that kind of stuff, the, the like the gauntlet and the judo throws and all that, it's been making the rounds lately. A lot of people oh, are yeah. talking about uh, belt promotions and what you have to go through. So what's humane? What's not? What, <laughs> uh, according to Crowther, barbaric. Which yeah, he's not wrong. That thing was just savagely awful. Oh like, my I, wife! My wife finally saw that picture. That was great when she goes. Are those their stripes? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I, I shared a picture of my back after I went through the gauntlet, <laughs> and you could see individual stripes of their belt marked on my back. <laughs> and that was a two-day after picture. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's bad. It's really yeah. bad. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, the more I'm you know, talking about it and uh, discussing it on, online and, and to friends and, oh, and yeah. family, the more I'm against it. Like, Really? I, 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 yeah, I am. I'm changing my mind. Like. Because if it's a thing at all, you're you're gonna somehow be pressured into doing it. Yeah, you're gonna feel it's a necessity. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying everybody will. Some people will be like, no, I don't care. But some people are. They just feel a lot of peer pressure. I'm that kind of guy. <laughs> you can peer pressure me into anything. Yeah, I know it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking whiskey is a prime example. <laughs> yes, yes, it's very easy. <laughs> exactly. I just formulized, no, I'm not. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't want any. Here's your cup. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, when it gets it, when it gets like that, when they're, when they're what, do you, what do you call it? Like a DDT or something that that guy had happened That was him? like an atomic drop. Atomic drop. So he picks him up over his head and slams him on his back as hard as he possibly could. It was disgusting. D- uh, ridiculous. Like it's, I don't know what country that was from. Uh, yeah, some it, third world country. Just, yeah, some, they were outdoors. There was a ton of people around it. And the, the guy, you could tell he was hurt. I mean, oh, he af- was Well, he got up. thrown two times before, not like a judo toss or anything. He was just kind of thrown. Yeah, body slammed. Right? Body slammed. Yeah. And then the head coach, obviously, literally lifts him up to his chest and spikes him on the crown of his back. Yeah. And he stayed there. For a yeah, yeah, and, it, and the crowd starts clapping. Yeah, like, the, why, why you, don't clap? What the? Yeah, that's not jujitsu. You could literally, if you did that to me, you'd literally break me. Like that'd be the. That end would of snap, all. dude. It could snap your neck. Yeah, like if he would have landed anywhere higher, he snap his neck. Yeah, like yeah, I'm thinking, you know, discs would slip, bones would break. I, you know, all kinds of soft tissue damage. I don't need that. I'm bad enough. <laughs> <laughs> I break myself. Thank you. Yeah, you know, and I, I want more people to join this. And if that's a thing anywhere, people aren't going to join this sport. Well, no, those kind of videos get out. People are like, that's what they do. Right. They yeah. don't care what country that was. in. No, no. They just think that uh, jujitsu is savagery and it's not. No, the window <laughs> watcher that just walks by. You should have seen the guy's face. Forgot to tell you that. The no, other day. missed it. So we're, st- we're all rolling around and uh, it was advanced class. So we were doing some really right. goofy crap. And he go. this guy just walks by the front windows. Uh, the gym that we're at has all windows in the front. And he walked by so slow, and he looked like he was looking at people getting shot. Really? <laughs> like, mouth agape. Like, <laughs> like what? oh? What is this nonsense? <laughs> and he kind of stopped and then kept going. I'm like, yeah. So if you Are they trying to kill each other or make man babies? <laughs> I can't understand which what? one. So when did they start pajama wrestling right. in <laughs> Rapids? Like, come on in. It's fun. But those kind of people, you know, he might think that's kind of interesting, and then it goes, oh, well, I'll look up the video. Right. Oh, yeah. that guy just got dropped on his head. <laughs> that person who comes up, <laughs> atomic drop. Nope. nope. I'm going to join Taekwondo. <laughs> <laughs> so is there a CrossFit gym? Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> no one hits you at CrossFit, right? I don't know. That CrossFit actually looks harder than what we do. 
Like you see ever no, seen no, no, no. videos? Get it right. Bro. It looks stupid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, jumping on boxes is not my jam. It doesn't look fun. Yeah, it's like, oh man, fight broke out. Yeah. Do, Jump in the box. Yeah, do what <laughs> what are the uh, Olympic lifts, but for reps. Uh no. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. 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 Th- that the looks back like- swinger? I don't know what the hell that was, <laughs> but it's a guy like swinging a bag in a circle around him. Oh. Like, like that might be self defense if you had the bag with you. Yeah, if you just hit somebody <laughs> with a bag, I'm, that's maybe, cool. Oh, fanny pack. Maybe that's what they're hey, planning take on. Take fanny pack. The and fanny swing pack around, just yeah. starts swinging around Heli- in a circle. Helicopter fight people. The fanny pack. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds yeah. about CrossFit to me. <laughs> so my my wife and I were discussing. I'm not. I I think I read on a article about where the gauntlet came from, and it sounds like somebody made it up as a joke, and then really? it, it just took off. Yeah. So it wasn't always a thing, and then somebody made it up like, ah, this is funny. We're we're brutal and we're savage. And then that's just kind of what people do. Really? I think so. I might be wrong. I'd actually like to talk to somebody that knows, like Croiler. He probably knows where it came from and all he that. He could, yeah. yeah. He's a big historian. But I, I, yeah, I'm, yeah, from what I read, I'm not sure how true it was. that. Uh, and I forget I forget the name of the gentleman that, that invented it. But even he says, nope, no, that's uh, he wants to get away from it. And he, he kind of feels bad for it. Yeah, that it's even out there. Yeah. So kind of like, stupid. Kind of like the guy that invented the Keurig cups. He kind of feels guilty now that the landfills are getting full of them. He's like, man, I made this awesome invention, and now he's kind of butt hurt that it's, <laughs> it's just because it was trash. <laughs> it's like, oh, no, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> I'm a millionaire yeah. of a world that I'm killing. Exactly. Wonderful. Yeah, my children are going to love me. It's awesome. <laughs> my kids can live in a house yeah. of Keurig cups. Yes. Recycle Keurig cups. Yeah, I, I, you know, in, in my opinion, clearly, but, you know, Helio Gracie wanted a jiu-jitsu for the smaller, weaker man. Yeah. And ergo, if you're small, weak, you know, you, you want this sport. But he had to prove to the world that, hey, this is the best martial art. So he would do the uh, the fight clubs, if you will. So he yeah. would fight everybody proving his system. <clears throat> well, maybe that got carried away into, uh, hey, we're the baddest fighting system on the planet and we have to be the toughest at everything. And that's kind of how maybe some of the gauntlet stuff got started, just kind of proving your... Yeah, superiority yeah. and right. toughness. I don't know. I could be wrong. I have no idea. I'm speculating. It kind of makes sense. Off here. Well, and, you know, or it could just be straight mob mentality hazing. Maybe. I mean, honestly, because if you the videos that I, you've seen come out, man, a bunch of them are out there now, of like a hazing. You know, the the gauntlet. Guys are just laughing and like, no, like how is that fun? Right. I mean, if I'm rolling with you and you're in my gym, you're part of my family. Yeah. And I'm going to attack you. With a belt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it wasn't that punishment when we were kids? Yep, yep. Pretty yep. sure it was. Not not for me. <laughs> <laughs> not for me either, but... Mm. Way to screw up my story, yeah, well, Paul. You know, I, I do know people that have been hit by belts, and it's not cool. Like, yes, I not guess, cool of course. Yeah. No, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's barbaric. It is. It is. But yeah, I'm, I'm all about, like, if we're going to celebrate, let's do it with cake and ice cream. Make it like a birthday party. Like cake and ice cream yeah, first. Cake and ice cream. Or, you know, whiskey. <laughs> no, a, little, a little difficult for the kids. <laughs> I, mean, I know they don't do that. Yeah, I was like, well, how about still. cake and ice cream for the kids, whiskey for the adults. I like it. Or wine. F- depending. Depending. Yes. Yeah. Depending. Yeah. Good Bud Light for some no. people that hate no. themselves. <laughs> 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 that hate a good drink. That love water that tastes like hell. Exactly. You like drinking dirty water, and you'll love Bud Light. Blah. They're not. <laughs> <laughs> Blah. Yeah. You know, good I, description. I'm not, I, you know, I'm, I'm not a good person to, uh, to critique beer because I don't like pretty much any beer. Yeah, you do call cider beer. I. Uh, yeah. You do. It, what, what's that stuff I drink? Cider. Cider. Yeah. Yeah. Cider. Beer. Hard cider. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. when I say beer, I always do air quotes. Yeah. To be fair, beer. To me, it is beer. Air quote, beer. beer. Like, what is this? It's beer. I was no, so confused no, when not. you handed me one. You're like, you want a beer? I'm like, sure. This is a cider, Paul. Right. <laughs> is this is this for your children? Like, <laughs> is, <laughs> what, what do you want me to do with this? Well, drink it. It's delicious. Which is really funny because you drink whiskey and truly enjoy whiskey. Yeah, whiskey's good. It is good. Beer tastes like beer. But Shit. <laughs> just, <laughs> See, I agree. I don't. I've, I've always tried to force myself yeah. to like. Beer. There's a, there's a couple that I don't hate, but I'm not gonna go buy them. No, they're fruity, but they still don't cover up. No, the not even fruity. Some of the some of the founder stuff. We got this founders in uh, Michigan. Oh, they're they, all over now. Oh man, they they make 
probably the best beer that you know. I'll, well, I was I don't know. I'm not a beer guy. I'm, I'm just talking. Gonna, about? I'm gonna make shit up. <laughs> she had words and such. Words, <laughs> words, babbles, babbles. <laughs> Beer. <laughs> there's 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 some like I think one's called a backwoods bastard or a dirty bastard. Dirty bastard. I, I'm yeah. not mad at those. I like those, but really, I, I would never just go buy one for myself because there's cider. <laughs> there's cider out there to be right. No, they're, they're right next to each other. Like, what am I going to get? Something delicious and nummy, <laughs> or beer? <laughs> nummy mm. is the operative word. <laughs> nummy. Nummy. Yeah. The only time a beer is acceptable, in my opinion, if if it's like 100 degrees out there and I did yard work for six hours and the beer is like iced ice cold and you're looking to get more dehydrated perfect yes <laughs> and i'm like, like a couple of sips like i can't drink the whole beer <laughs> don't <laughs> but, be ridiculous <laughs> yeah let's not get carried away but then you know like a good miller light no uh, uh, corona uh, even worse yeah uh, corona no um, i don't mind a corona like i said if it's really hot out and i'm thirsty i'll drink one otherwise nah. i'm really to the point i don't i just don't drink it i no. don't care for it i don't bother no. I'll, I'll drink one to be polite to somebody else. Yes. Anyway. <laughs> I was just going to say that. Like, if I'm at a house and like, yeah. you want a beer? Did I, did oh, I, yeah. Have I said the IPA story on this podcast? Mm, I don't think so. Okay. We haven't talked about beer much. No? We so, don't like beer. No. <laughs> this is an awesome beer podcast today. <laughs> yeah, we love beer. We, we don't know anything about it. We're just going to slam beer. <laughs> so we go over to uh, uh, friends of our house. And, and they're, we don't hang out. We're acquaintances. And we uh, our daughters go to school together. Yes. So yeah, we went uh, the forced oh, adult play date. Yeah. So in the summer we have uh, books and ice cream, and it was right by this lady's house. So we, uh, me and another buddy, met up at their house for books and ice cream, and then we just walked down the street, and they'd give away free books, and they would give kids ice cream, and it was fun. Hence the name, books, books and, and ice cream. cream. They get it. All right. <laughs> <clears throat> Beating a dead horse. So I'm trying to make conversation with this lady's husband. And super nice guy. We just don't have much in common. So I'm starting to ask him, hey, what do you do for fun? What are you into? And microbrewery brewery came up. Like his favorite thing is to go to uh, the local breweries. Brew, yeah, whatever. Liquor store and, and get uh, a new and different IPA or microbrew or whatever. That's his thing. He, every Friday, that's he goes and gets a six pack and he gets different ones. And so he's telling me all about it. And I'm trying to actually interest it. <laughs> like I give zero cares. Oh yeah, for sure. None, but I'm, you know, but he's talking now finally. So I finally got him to talk. He's yep. passionate about something. So I'm, Hey, I'm on board. I'll listen to you. So he, uh, he offers me a beer and he offers, uh, my buddy James a beer and he goes, do you want an IPA? And do, I don't know what an IPA is. Indiana I, Indian pale ale. I don't know. Still don't care. So I don't know what the hell that means. Apparently just, it means tastes like shit. <laughs> I hate IPAs. <laughs> he gives me this oh. he gives me this beer and he's all excited. And I crack it open and I got it up to my nose and I knew Oh yeah, it's aggressive. I knew at that point <laughs> I'm like, Oh, I screwed up. Like I, I I screwed up. So I took a sip and it almost came back out. <laughs> like I I almost spit it on his floor <laughs> oh this is this is awful and you know james is like whatever he's a beer drink he likes yeah, it. so he's, yeah. he's fine not you know not his big thing he's but, a normal guy yeah he's yeah a normal man you know a real man yeah he'll have a coors light unlike or myself yeah <laughs> yeah we're much yeah. more frou frou yeah, fru, yeah hence the cider beer whatever so uh, but we would drink whiskey first yes we would yeah. so we uh <laughs> we're drinking this beer and having conversation i'm trying to drink it really, really slow. So it touched my lips. I'm trying to like just force it down my gullet and it's awful. So I'm like, all right, <laughs> I'm trying, I'm, try, I'm trying to think of a plan on how to get rid of this beer. So I can't just dump it down the sink. I can't not finish it. I thought that's rude. Like that's just not how my mama raised me. Like if you, your if you mama get, raised you to drink all your beer. <laughs> well, you know, if you go over to somebody's house, you're not going to, you know, and they feed you. I don't care if you like it or not. You eat the food and you act like you like it. Oh yes. And it's of course. respectful. Oh yeah. So, you know, and especially he's into his beer. And I acted like I cared, so I'm already balls deep. I'm so like, you should have been a dick right off the bat? Yes. Beer stupid, shut your face. It, it would have benefited <laughs> me to be a dick in this. <laughs> so I'm like, all right, I'm just going to guzzle it. I'm going to just down it and be done with it. So I tried. Failed. Like, <laughs> my, my body went, no, rejected. <laughs> so... So I'm like, all right, I'm going to have to keep on sipping it. And it got warmer. And oh. I, you know, it's over the course. Like, an, it took me an hour to get rid of it. Get, and it's a can. A can. You couldn't, in an it's, hour, and, you couldn't get rid of a can? It, well, it was about an hour, and I finally got rid of this can of IPA. Oh, my God. It was awful. It was the worst thing I've ever experienced. Super bitter. Ugh. Oh, yeah. So we, get, we, we, uh, we leave and get in the car. My wife got this shit-eating grin on her face. And she goes, hey, 
how was your beer? Because <laughs> she knew. Like, oh, and she's laughing at me so hard. I'm like, oh, it's the worst experience of my life. Yeah. yeah I'll, I've I'll, had that before. And I take the biggest gulps of that shit. I'm like, this is going to go away. Yeah. And it's going to go away fast. See, you're a bigger man than me. I tried the gulping thing. It wasn't happening. I was going to puke. I literally do like the kid thing. I put as much as I can in my mouth. How I'm many, like, how, how many people do you think are going to be super offended that we what <laughs> shit ton. We're we going to get the classic. Be half, like, what the hell's your problem, we girl? Just lost half our listeners. Like, <laughs> screw you guys. Less than your shit. <laughs> I love IPA. Yeah, no. I don't <laughs> no, we're fine with I that. You're not like IPA. You're no friend of mine. <laughs> uh, he was kidding. Yeah, please, right. No, please no, don't leave us. No, just joking. <laughs> <laughs> but we hate IPA. Yeah, I'm still, still not like an IPA. No. All right, let's get away from beer. All right, we don't cool. even like beer. Hey, so we had uh, our second guest on the podcast on, uh, well, last week. Yeah, we recorded Earlier last week. week. Yeah. yeah. Tuesday. It's Tuesday. Friday now. In case you care. Is it? No, it's Saturday. Saturday. Oh, crap. It's Saturday now. Yes. Yeah. So we had uh, Monster Trevor Morris on Tuesday. We're going to drop his podcast on Thursday. So, Correct. Yep. This should drop on Tuesday, right? Yes. This will cool. drop on Tuesday. Yep. So. And then- uh, Hi, Thursday. everyone. It's Hi. Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, it's Saturday, but it's Tuesday for you. <laughs> Unless you listen to it late, in which case it's whatever. Yeah, it's whatever day it doesn't you're, matter. you're on. It's fine. You know, I really like- uh, He was a great interview. He was. He was. A lot uh, of fun. Yep. Yep. Fun guy. A lot of cool stories- yeah, where he came from, yeah, we're like gonna that. like it. We we gave we gave him as much shit as we thought we could get away with because he is an active <laughs> cage fighter. <laughs> yeah, he's fighting Muay Thai. And, yeah, he just you know. yeah, he already beat the brakes off me once. I don't need to happen again. So and not for real. Yeah, I, I wanted to give him more shit, but you know, I can take what you can get. <laughs> <laughs> take what you get without getting hurt. I, so. I'm I'm liking interviewing though. Like I didn't think I would enjoy it as much as I did. I like it. It's fun. It makes our job easier. Like, uh, we ask you questions and you just talk and we listen. See, this isn't hard to me. And we interject. You're just so nervous. It's well, hard. You know what sucks right now? Because I got this fleece on. You're sweating like a son of a That was a mistake. Like, I was cold. I came in. I'm like, oh, I'm kind of cold. I'm going to throw a fleece on. And I forgot to take it off before the podcast. I'm going to have to have you, like, just talk. Oh, yeah. That's will fine. I, will I strip down naked in front of you? Because I'm a sweaty mess. Oh, my God, dude. It's been 20 minutes. Uh, 22 minutes. To be exact. <laughs> And yeah, it's it, the ship sailed. It's awful. That's so funny. And you also forgot water. I did. I'm parched. I, I had this bottle of whiskey sitting in front of me. I'm going, I wonder if that would help. It will not. No, it'll I, taste wonderful. Yeah, it'll taste good. It is quite good. Yeah. Thanks, Maybe, Chad. You'll have to like recite some shit or sing a song while I go take my shirt off and get some water. Good Lord. What? What are you doing? I don't know. I'm going to throw you under the bus. That's like, fine. Inter- entertain them. Uh, do it. Ready? No. Go. No, I'm not. Start talking. No, no one likes me. Uh, you're, you're the star here. Whatever. Everyone loves Paul. So uh, a bit of exciting news is next Tuesday, we get to have Morgan on. Yes. I am i can't tell you how excited I am. Dude, Morgan it's on. so I, great. I'm, I'm surprised you agreed to it. I was shocked. Knowing who we are. Yeah. Like, we're complete morons. I think yeah. she thought about it a little <laughs> bit more after she was like, sure. Yeah, sure. Oh. Oh. She, she asked me, she's like, um, do I get to see the questions first? I'm like, no. Are they creepy? <laughs> God, no. Uh yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course they're creepy. So yeah, you know I was it's, kind of it's ex- Kip and Paul. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm stoked. Oh yeah, she's gonna like, be awesome. Yeah. I'm excited to have Croyler on one day. Like he's pretty cool. He's an all right black belt <laughs> kind. You know, I hear he's kind of legit. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> you know, the average, wreck you. average black belt. Let's be honest. Oh but my Morgan, God, you're baldy. <laughs> <laughs> but Morgan, she's like. A goddess. She's like, the ginger Wonder Woman. She. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. She's like Wonder Woman, except real. Yeah, like she she's can awesome. do that stuff. She can yes. literally murder people and fly, and fly, <laughs> with, and fly with swords. Uh, she has an invisible jet. Yeah. and uh, a lasso of truth. Yeah, she scares. Sounds me. about right. Yeah, Crawler. I'll throw him under the bus. He doesn't scare me like uh, Morgan does. You are <laughs> flipping dead. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fun. Why does he even talk to us? I, I, mystery. Yeah, it's a mystery. It's me. a complete mystery to me. Also, yeah, I don't. I don't get it. Hey, Broiler, uh, love you. How you doing, Broiler? <laughs> uh, Paul's address is. <laughs> <laughs> can't can't wait for my my private lesson, buddy. Yeah, <laughs> we'll, I know. We'll get there. Oh, you know what? I just started sweating more. Like it just got worse. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, we're gonna walk in. And he's just gonna look at me, give me uh, one finger, and go. Yeah. No, hold on. Hold on. I, 
Come here, Paul. You need to take care of one thing. You know that gauntlet that I was so opposed to? Yeah. Not right now. <laughs> it's actually going to be a gauntlet yeah. of wrist locks. Yeah, you, you, <laughs> you're going to wish you were in a gauntlet in about 30 seconds. <laughs> Neon belly. Like, oh, God, I don't need that. Oh, I got to post that meme. His meme is awesome. Oh, who wrote the meme? The guy, the guy he was doing it to in the photo. The <laughs> oh, wait till you see it, people. It's wonderful. Uh, so, so the guy that was getting squashed. By his neon belly. By his neon belly. Wrote the meme about Croyler's neon belly. Yes. Yeah. The, oh, the other ways of describing it. It's awesome. Oh, that's fantastic. It's hilarious. Yeah, the guy's my new hero. <laughs> that's fantastic. That's a great meme. <laughs> he looks uncomfortable as hell. Too. <laughs> he looks like he's dying. And then he made a meme. You can you can actually see his soul in the in the picture if you <laughs> zoom in. <laughs> it it's just floating leave. above him <laughs> right. and with just a shitty you know, like, Oh my god. He's looking down at his body with those like his arms up, like, what the fuck am I supposed to do with that? Like <laughs> doesn't even hurt anymore. <laughs> Why are you killing me, bro? <laughs> I'm dead. Then he starts coming off, the soul starts sucking back in the body, like, all right. Back. Oh, one real quick thing about Corler. He had a great seminar. I think it was at Diesel. Just loved it. Scion or Diesel or both? I, he had both. I, both of them, I think, raved about him, but I think Diesel is the one that, like, just really, really enjoyed his time. There. Nice. I'm pretty Which, sure of course. So I mean, come on. One just raved more. No, that's what I'm saying. They both enjoyed yeah. it. You son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> did, did you see the, uh, the, uh, the backdrop at Scion's school? Was it Scion? I think it was Scion. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Scion. I thought it was Diesel. They had this epic backdrop. I'm not sure if it was a mural painted or... Oh, yeah, that was that was Dude. Scion. That was sick. That was, it was legit. Like a, it was like a 30-foot wall of mural. I don't know who did that. But and one it, consistent mural, too. I, like, dope. Yeah, I want my basement to look like that. I'm, <laughs> I got to finish it anyway. So how about murals? Make it, make it look like... <laughs> it's murals I wanna make, everywhere. I want to make it look like Hawaii rather than, you know... Cotton candy. <laughs> that we, we do have cotton candy right yeah. now. Oh, it's but, so much closer. But I have lights now. It's not so dead. <laughs> that sounds so lame, though. I have lights. <laughs> so, uh, hey, Paul. I'm so Everyone excited. has lights. Yeah, no, okay, I have more lights. It doesn't look creepy as creepy down here. That's yeah. Creepy. Oh, no, it looks great. I can actually see Paul. I can see the sweat beating up on his head. Why don't you take off your sweatshirt? Chad? Okay, you can talk? Yeah, I can okay, talk. Okay, I'm going to take my headphones off and take my stuff. Hold on. Yeah, give this me, is ridiculous. That. You know, we could edit this out, no, but we're not going no. to because that's not how I roll. Oh, this is gross. Oh, oh my gosh, dude. You're a sweaty oh, mess. Sick. That was a gray shirt. It's now black. Eh. Hold on. That's disgusting. Nope. Ugh. Yeah, that uh, part. Yeah. <laughs> you like my sweaty armpits, bro? <laughs> yeah. It's hot. Oh, God. I knew I should have talked shit about Croyler. Yeah, mean, that was it, pretty stupid. I got scared. It's like I had the... Uh, the fight or flight response as I was talking shit. <laughs> it's like, oh no. <laughs> this is a mistake. But it was definitely Diesel. that And uh, Corolla said he had a great time there. Sweet. So, and uh, they evidently had a great time, just like that. we do. I mean, you learned so much from that guy. Yeah. It's crazy. 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 Yeah, it's my man crush. Don't take it. <laughs> yeah. He, yeah. <laughs> uh, after he listens to this, he's not going to like me anymore, so... Oh, no, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> I, Chad's going to kill me. Croyler will kill you. Yeah. yeah, but, gonna, yeah. Croyler would probably be quicker. It's probably better. Yeah. You know, mm. if, you know it's kind of like getting uh, getting nuked. I want to catch that bomb. You know, I don't want to get the, I don't want to get the fall out. Yeah, I don't want to be running away yeah, and just, then just, just become a skeleton yeah, running just, away. Just catch know? that no. in my lap, you know. I'll, I'll eat that. <laughs> what were we even talking about? I don't remember. Uh, what do you else want to talk about? I don't oh, know. yeah, yeah. Um, being, being uh, this is a stupid segue. That like was this, a horrible segue. Okay, this segue When you sucks. say it's a segue, this is a segue, even worse. Oh, we're going to talk about other shit now. <laughs> should, should I do the topics from now on? Yeah. Because yeah, I, I can do segues. I, I just ran out of steam on other stuff. So or I'd like to think I can do segues. Yeah. We, okay, we have a couple couple options. Ooh, we, give me options. I'll pick. Options. We could talk about stereotypes. I uh, love stereotypes. Uh, BJJ. Like we're yes. making these up just because they're funny, not because we know them. Correct. But they're hilarious. So They are hilarious yeah. and they might hold true to you. Or... Ooh. Or, or we can talk about how you can tell if somebody likes you or not in your Ooh, BJJ school. Let's start with that one. That one's kind of serious. Kind of. A little bit. Ish. Yes. Ish. So you know how you, you, you meet new people and you roll with them and you don't know if they like you or not. Like that you, happens to me a lot. You're not getting a good air. Well, because you're fucking weird. <laughs> so <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's appropriate. But for somebody I, like I to, you. Whenever you have to explain <laughs> your sense of humor. 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 Not a good <laughs> humor. Humor, it's not a good thing. And I have to do it constantly. Yeah. Like, no, no, I'm joking. It's like, no, you're not. No, I am. I'm just being silly. I'm that dumb. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I am. 
<laughs> so, yeah, there, there's there's no better honesty than rolling with somebody, especially over and over and over again, because you, you get a sense of how they feel about you as a person by the way they roll with you. Example me. Um, so if they don't care for you, they're oh, going to try. Oh, so you go to that one first? Oh, yeah. Because that's me? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So this is, you know. <laughs> totally fine with that. Yeah. They will ruin you. Or at least try to. Yeah, I was going to say, Every single yeah. time. Oh, they, yeah. they, they will give you nothing. It is never pl- playful. And you, they can, you can tell they're tr- not trying to hurt you so much, but kind of. Yeah, you know they're I mean? trying to win. Yeah. And the mm-hmm. uh, hurting you. <laughs> yeah. Even, if, you know, the, the hurting you parts yeah. is part of it. <laughs> so there's, there's people that roll hard and they roll technical, but they're not hurting you. And they're. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's given, it's given back and forth. Yeah, for sure. Yep. But somebody that doesn't care for you, <laughs> probably going to mess you up. Yeah. You think I'm right? I do, actually. I'm making it up off the top of my head. I, I do, but I also think everyone hates yeah. me. Cause, <laughs> so. That's, that's because they do. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> why do you think I roll so hard with you, Kip? Like, we just discussed this. God, you do, don't I you? I do. You refuse <laughs> to let me win. <laughs> Like when Paul rolls with it, so we're going to apply this to us yes. right now. Yes, we are. So you can tell I hate Kip yeah. <laughs> by the fact that I give him nothing <laughs> gives, and I take from him everything. And he's a blue belt. <laughs> he's such an <laughs> asshole. I'm a white belt. This dude's a blue belt eight years deep in the sport. Uh, yeah. And he won't let me win. So Paul always has this playful, stupid, smiley face thing on, having fun with people. Unless it's a higher belt or something, they're working, having a hard roll. But with me... Looking at you, Jesse. Looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> it fits. Yeah. Dude's a beast. I know, he's awesome. Why do we always... That's all we ever say. He's awesome. He's yeah. a beast. And moving on. So, Paul has this totally different face for me. It's, you're not going to win face. Yes. <laughs> and it never leaves. Yes. No, no. We can't even do drills. He's like, no. I'm just going to do something yeah. so difficult, no. he doesn't know what to okay. do. <laughs> okay, take his back and uh, see if they can get out. No. You will. You <laughs> well, will Kip not. can't get out, so. Okay, okay we're going to pass guard. You shall not pass. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. I'm so glad you admitted it, though. So we can move forward well, now. I'm, how am I going to not admit that? It's clearly <laughs> obvious. <laughs> so mean to me. Yeah. Well, as soon as you give me trouble with anything, I'm like, hey, hey, Chad. Having problem with the knee shield. <laughs> yeah, I know. What the hell is that? I pissed him off with a roll where he could not get around my knee shield. No, I could get around it. It just took me a minute. I'm like, this is crap. Like, it should it's be. A, yeah, yeah, I kept it you off of there. Yeah. It should be easy. You're it's a blue belt. Yeah, yeah. And I'm not. Yep. It gave me, you, you got, uh, I was fussy. <laughs> you got <laughs> fussy and like, then went to the coach dang. and went, stomped his yeah. feet and said, show me how to be feet this. I, I should be able to go through <laughs> Kip's guard like a hot knife through butter. Yes. And I wasn't able to. No. Fix it. <laughs> Bullshit. I need to drill this one thousand times so it never happens again. Yes, but you're now now we're explaining the exception to the rule because I don't think you hate me. Oh, I do. Damn. I do. <laughs> oh, no, Damn. no, you're right. So maybe we're just making shit up off the top of our head. No, but I think you're right yeah. though. For the most part, like it's different. Our mentality yeah. is, yeah, I'm your buddy. Yeah, you've shown me a lot of stuff. I'm not. Gonna, <laughs> you're not going to let the guy. That you hang out with all the time, that you've shown all your tricks, yeah. beat you. Well, the thing is, it's is, understandable if, yeah. to me. If I, as soon as I beat you with something, I show you what I did. Yeah, exactly. How to stop? Yeah, it, it never makes yeah. me like. I never felt like right, you're no. trying to hurt me no. or be a dick. <laughs> it was just, it's just <laughs> fun that like I knew you were trying harder and you denied it. Yeah, <laughs> you're like, no, <laughs> no uh, whatever, you yeah. suck, uh, yeah. no. whatever. No, I don't have an ego. No, uh, no, maybe, no, maybe a little. Oh look, Kip, that's a knee shield. Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> The one time like, I what? did it to you, the yeah. look on your face, I thought you were just going to buy something. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, this is how you pass a guard. Yeah. Flying me. Yeah. What, uh, what side of your neck hurts, kid? Yes. Um, we'll pass that way. <laughs> it's all of them. <laughs> you did that one day, too. This guy goes left constantly. Well, that's actually, that I, can, I can't go right. Yeah, no, you can't. <laughs> he doesn't have the can't. body to do it. It doesn't matter. So I hurt my neck, and it hurt bad, and I couldn't really stop anything with my left arm, and this asshole passed my guard 37 times to the left. I'm yeah. like, oh, God, it hurts so much. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, back to our point, though. I mean, yes. jiu-jitsu is, you know, pretty honest, like, on the mat. You can't, you, you, your jiu-jitsu don't lie, much like my hips don't lie. My jujitsu, 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 jujitsu. <laughs> That's the Japanese uh, version. Get into this a little bit more. My jujitsu <laughs> does not lie. No, 
Yeah, it so, doesn't. I think you're right, though. I never thought about it until you said it. Yeah. You can tell. I think you can tell a lot about a person by the by how they roll. Ooh, what you can you tell say, by me? Um, not with you, because that doesn't count. Ooh, yeah, yeah. We're we're like a special breed. Like, yeah. we just <laughs> we just screw with each other. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah like when you're not trying to not let me win. Yeah. We really accomplish little yeah. to nothing. It's kind of like fighting with your wife. You know? <laughs> yeah. it's, like, it's, it's just not going to do much. No. It's, it's not going to be productive. Pointless, yeah. I, I'm, not a, I'm not a good person to answer that, Kate. Yeah, but you've seen me roll with others. How do I roll with others? You, you're, you're actually too nice. I know I am. You're too nice. And it's weird because you and I are the same. Like I don't. You know, I don't want to put a lot of pressure on people because I, I want to like float on top of them. And it's just not how you do jujitsu. <laughs> Is that how you do jujitsu? There's yeah. no pressure in jujitsu. Right. Yeah. Not about pressure at all. Ask Croiler. He knows. <laughs> yeah, he's got, First thing he'll teach you is how to like, float. Exactly. Just got no no pressure. You know, Nia and Billy, no pressure there at all. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Yeah. Oh, God. You know, yeah, there's yeah, there's such thing as being as being too nice. There's respectful and not being a dick. And then there's being just too easy where it's not effective. Like mm. you got, you got to try hard enough to be effective. Like you got to yep. get, you got to do the cross face. You got to do the knee and belly. I know. You got to put your shoulder into their chin. You got to, you know, you have to do that. It's part I of jujitsu. But th- I just struggle. Well, yeah. And then there's Cause other- it's not, it's not a conscious thought. Right. It's not like, Oh, Oh, I don't want to do this. Right. It literally, I stop myself. Yep. It but fucking sucks. If, if you just roll to the level of the person you're ro- rolling with, that's fine. So for example, if I'm rolling with your wife, and I just roll her up into a ball and smash her. Sounds fun. I'm being a dick. Yes. Like, there's no other way to put that. Like, if, yeah, I'm if you guys haven't her... called on or haven't le- listened to earlier ones, my wife is a single stripe, been doing it for two or three months. Yeah. Yeah. She's, she's brand new and she White weighs ball. 12 pounds, soaking wet. That's giving her some. Yeah. She's giving her <laughs> 10 and a half. But yeah, if, if I roll with somebody like your wife or, or Mel or, um, just a newbie. Any, just, just a, newbie. a newer any, person. Any newbie, yeah. yeah. Or anybody smaller. Yeah. And I'm smashing them with everything I have. You're being a dick. Yeah, don't, for sure. Don't be that guy. Like, give give them something. Let them do stuff to you. Or work ask them what of, they want to yeah. work out of. Like, I yeah. always ask. I'm not, help, I can't teach, so I'm more than just sort of show them what I would do in right. a situation. So I'm like, well, what do you what do you want to work on? And Mel's yeah. really good at going, I want to work on getting out of this guard. Yeah. I have a real tough time. I'm like, perfect. I'm a good guy to work on because I'm a dick with my guard. Like, I may not be good, but yeah. I'm going to hold on to you. <laughs> yeah. When I was over at your house and I was talking to your wife and yep. her and Mel get there early because they don't do the advanced class, but they get there early and drill like a guard pass together. Yeah, and for tell, sure. Yeah. So, yeah, a- absolutely do the stuff like that. But, yeah, if you're if you're higher ranking or if you're a bigger gentleman or a bigger person, just let them do stuff. Don't just smash people. Yeah, don't and smash if, your yeah. partner. And if you have somebody in side control for three minutes of a three-minute round, what are you accomplishing? Yeah, does it make you feel good about yourself? <laughs> what have, yeah, what have you learned? How about you do a thing called jujitsu, like and make it fun? Yeah, you know, I totally agree. It's already hard. Make make it fun. Yeah, and I'm a complete moron when I roll, yeah. so I start a stupid thing like figure fouring yeah. someone's arm. <laughs> but you know, <laughs> fine. But I, I get it though because ego. You know, yes, leave ego at the door. I I understand that. But we I also, talked about this. But a lot. I also understand it's hard to do. And it is, it, and it takes practice to leave your ego at the door. So you can practice by just get, start giving people stuff. Like if you know you're that guy that smashes people and rolls them up and tries to show how badass you are. Do you are, think they know? I don't know if they know or not. I don't think they do. Because I don't not. think – Well, now they can think about it. So if you're listening to the show and you're the guy that just smashes people that you can smash, don't. Just, uh, you know, you're not a bad person. No, just not at all. Give, give your partners that you know that you can do that to. Let them get stuff. Work out of that. You don't yeah, have to coach sure. them. You don't have to coach them. No, don't just, coach them. Let them work on their game. If they ask you questions, answer the questions. That's cool. But give them opportunities to tap you out. Work on your defenses. Work on your base. Work yeah, on your and that's you yeah. know, and that's what Ben was doing with me. Ben's a blue belt, about to go for, to purple. Yeah, um, test for his purple. So he's well experienced and he's freaking fun as hell to roll with. And he's big, lanky guy like me. Yeah. Well, not big. He's lanky <clears throat> and skinny. He's weighs less than me by ways. Really? <laughs> yeah, he does. Like twenty pounds. He's, Holy crap! Yeah, yeah, he's pretty. Light compared to me, even so, maybe it's ten pounds. Pretty good for our size though, because yeah. we're both pretty skinny. But uh, I was rolling with him, and he wanted to work on his escape from armbar. Well, so he gave me the armbar essentially because I set it up well, and that's right. how Ben works. Like if you do it right, Ben will let you go, and that's what you should do. Yeah. And it was great because I actually did it right, nice. <laughs> and I stayed tight. And he goes, "I was gonna fight," and then I realized you were tight. <laughs> so yeah, if you do it right, it's hard to get yeah, out. Yeah, it is, and. uh 
I normally don't do that. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, that's what Ben did for me. Like, if Ben didn't want me to have that, I wouldn't have got it. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, I ben, may have done it right, yeah. but he could have stopped. Yeah. He would. He could have done anything to stop me. Yeah. But he didn't. I wish I could explain on the radio, on the podcast. Radio. Uh, how, radio. How, how non-ego somebody like Ben rolls. It's unreal. It's unreal. Like, I, I try my hardest to be somebody that people love to roll with. Like, I want to be the guy that everybody wants to roll with. You're kind of that way. People love rolling with you. I try. Yeah. But I also realize that I fail occasionally. Like, I, as soon as I'm done rolling, I can look back and go, hmm, I, I don't feel good about what I did. Well, like, sometimes I still you don't try it. hard enough. It, well, yeah, sometimes I don't try hard enough. Sometimes I try too hard. So, yeah. You know what I mean? So I, I can kind of gauge how I roll a little better after I'm done rolling. And, mm-hmm. I, you know, and because I'm crazy... When I go to bed at night, I think about it. I replay it all oh again. God. Every roll, just kind of like, yeah, just play it. Should I have done this? Is that why that? you try to go to bed at like 7.30? Because you're up for four hours thinking you, about it? You're actually not wrong. Yes. Like, okay, the days I go to bed after jujitsu, yeah. I can't sleep. Cause Are that's you all, serious? That's all I think about. Oh, my gosh. Dude, I, I literally can't sleep. It sounds like a prison. You know what sucks, <laughs> though? Podcast days, same thing. Like so this, you're, ro- this rolls around. Oh yeah. So you're Monday, yourself. Monday Jiu Jitsu, Tuesday podcast, Wednesday Jiu Jitsu, Thursday potentially podcast. Yes. <laughs> Friday maybe a podcast. Oh shit. Oh, for, and open mat. So oh, open uh, yeah, yep. open mat did open mat Friday. That was fun. I, I wanna. I, oh, oh, I, I won't oh, be able so to come Ed, anymore. Ed. By the way. Well, oh, that's right. Yeah. Got a job. My job suck. goes past five o'clock. Boo. Yes. No. Speaking of open mat, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw somebody under the bus. I told myself I'd never do that on the on the podcast, but I'm going to do it. But if it's Ed, it's cool. Ed. Ed, Ed. Ed, you son of a bitch. <laughs> he came to open mat. Guess what he didn't have? A gi. Yeah, he didn't have a gi. You son of a bitch. How am I bitch. supposed to roll with somebody without a gi? <laughs> <laughs> we, neither one of us know. Yeah, I didn't know what to grab. I'm like just grabbing his head and trying to grab his <laughs> arms and he's slippery. <laughs> he's got too much energy. He's got, we're going. We're dude, rolling. that dude can go for dude, days. We're rolling again and again and again. And I'm like, do you need a break? He's like, no. Well, I need a break. <laughs> well, I need one, so go away. I have to go suck down this water bottle real quick. He's like, you ready? No. <laughs> no, I'm not ready. Still not I ready. still have my gi. I'm going to blame it on the gi. Like, he didn't have one on. I had one on. Yeah, I'm going to use excuses. There's a, lot, there's a lot of air difference, because <laughs> we've done. We've only got to work out without our gis on, like, once or twice when Justin was running class, because he does no gi. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he'll let you take it off. It was so nice. Once. <laughs> one, once ever, I think, for me. And he's done it twice nice. that I've been with him, yep. and it was wonderful. I, you know, I have mixed feelings because I don't like being too hot because I get that thousand yard stare and it, and it ruins me. Yes, but I get I don't get hurt as easy. I like the sauna feeling out of my joints. Like yeah, it might, it's I feel tough, so isn't it? much. You know, it's you know, <laughs> here's the shit thing about jujitsu. I'm gonna have one complaint. We'll do a warm up. We'll do all these warm ups. I'm gonna get hot and sweaty. Then we stop, and then we learn a move. So everybody stops. And then they slowly work on moves for 20 minutes. Yep. And then you're cold. And I can feel my body start to just stiffen up. Yep. And then as soon as it's as stiff as it's going to get, time to roll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, I can't do it. So There should needless, be a reverse order. Yeah. So needless to say, Ed's a dick. Yep. Ed. <laughs> How dare you, Ed, not bring a gi. You son of a bitch God. that's getting married sometime because oh, congratulations, congratulations and whatever. Ed. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm Big so props to thoughtful. You. Yeah. It was like two weeks ago. And <laughs> <laughs> hey, we had guests on. It was busy. We can't, you can't have a guest on and be like, wait, Ed's gotten uh, engaged. <laughs> yeah. No one knows Ed, so I don't think this is as yeah, important. Right. This, is, this is like a freebie show, like an in-betweener. In between. Yeah, I love these in-between shows. We in, just kind of babble. In-between episode. Yes, we'll and that. now we can go to my my thing. Oh, yeah. We're yeah, kind of yeah. ripping off uh, another place. Oh, we're, uh, we're Dude s- Perfect does this. From years ago, it's kind of where they got their start. Well, there's a few people. I've, I've seen it on BJJ, and it's hilarious. Have you? Cool. Ergo, it's, it, we want to bring it up. Yes. Because it's funny. We do it anyways. What is it? It's uh, jujitsu stereotypes. Yeah, that's right. The people in your gym. We, uh, please God, people in our gym, this isn't aimed at anyone. No. <laughs> I swear to you, Except it's not. Dad. Ed, you're a dick. Ed, yeah. <laughs> Same to Dad. Take <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God, I hope he has a really good sense of humor. Uh, if he doesn't, yeah. whoops. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Please still come a, back. Still a dickhead. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, before we keep on throwing him under the bus, I do want to say that he is, for a brand new guy that was a wrestler, 
He's a fun guy to roll with. Heck yeah. And, yeah. And Not he learns spazzy. quickly. Yeah, he asks good questions. He's fun. Yeah. He's going to be good. Yeah, and he, I asked him when <laughs> when he started, He rolled. I finally rolled with him after a little bit, and uh, he, he starts where I didn't know him at all. I didn't talk to him. I didn't even talk to you <clears> about him. I didn't know his name, so I introduced yeah. myself. And he, and that he pushed sexy me, new guy. He pushed me over, like pushed into me, and I go, you're a wrestler, aren't you? And he goes, yes. <laughs> yes. I'm like, he goes, how do you know? I'm like, because they, they you tried this. to tackle me. <laughs> I'm, we're, you tried to spike me in my chest <laughs> with your face. With your face. <laughs> so, and he goes, yeah, I kind of figured out that's bad. He goes, yeah. I got hurt a bunch, so I'm trying not to do yeah. that. I'm like, awesome. So. No, he settled right down quick, yeah, too. Like yeah, like right away. Yep. So, anyways, good guy, Ed. Yep. Still a Still dick. dick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so <laughs> the worst show ever. <laughs> oh Jesus! I so, love it. Well, before we go into uh, the jiu uh, jitsu stereotypes, you said dude perfect. Like, what's an example of a dude perfect stereotype? Uh, the one that I I liked was it was golf stereotypes. Yeah, because you're a fucking golfer. <laughs> it's a fucking golfer. That's what I do. And uh, they had like the angry golfer, the guy that every time it hits the ground, it's like, oh, it's ground's fault. <laughs> <laughs> The club thrower. It's ah, too. It's ah, too windy. This is bullshit. Exactly. Oh, it's gust. Oh, that club. Wrong club. Wrong club. Yeah. <laughs> and then yeah, the my club caddy th- told me the wrong <laughs> shit. <laughs> you don't have a caddy. Shit. <laughs> uh, they had club thrower. <laughs> <laughs> so you just freak out, hit the ground, and throw your club in the pond. Get those assholes <laughs> that like snap the club over their knee. I've seen that. Kind of impressive. I, no, it's not. not. No, really? it's not, dude. That's a hollow freaking piece of aluminum. It's, I could do it in a freaking heartbeat, and oh, I am crap. a wuss. Well, that sucks. Well, I'm no longer impressed. <laughs> yeah, you shouldn't be. Uh, a little well, man oh, did it when okay, I was going Okay, what, what about, what about like, uh, Bo Jackson breaking the bat over his knee? Is yeah, that that's impressive? fucking impressive. Okay, I got you. So, yeah, yeah that's still have great. that for a hero. Well, they, yeah, that's great. It's awesome. Okay, okay, what's the first stereotype you got? So, the first stereotype that, uh, that we wrote down was the smells like Play-Doh guy. <laughs> <laughs> like, what? <laughs> happened, happened once. Like, generally people smell like, you know, sweat. Nasty man. Yeah. Yes. Occasionally, woman. occasionally somebody will wear perfume, which I find fascinating. That's hilarious. That's <laughs> funny. I'm not mad at it though. They're just trying to be polite. No, like, it's you great. smell like perfume. Hey, you care. You oh, care yeah. about my nostrils. <laughs> and I like that. My well being. <laughs> <It's> right. <laughs> so I'll take that. But there's always there's a guy that's gonna walk in, gonna smell. I don't know, like play doh uh, or, or fast food. Fast food. <laughs> and you're like, oh man. For some reason, I really want McDonald's fries right now. <laughs> yeah, there's a, that guy that smells like he shouldn't. Like what? Yeah, just off. Yeah. You're just like, uh, you don't smell bad. You don't smell right yeah. either. <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you put your ghee in the kitty litter box to dry? <laughs> <laughs> so do you clean it with baking soda? Because I'm confused. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dip my geese in bourbon now. <laughs> yeah, just bourbon barrel geese. And as you sweat, everything burns. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Get that in your eyes. No! Oh, oh, God. Yeah. You thought a dirty belt was bad. <laughs> God, the, the next one um, is yes. indicative of myself. And, prob- oh. and probably, I'm going to go with 90%. Maybe even 100%. 90%? Maybe even 100%. Because no matter oh. how much people trash on this, you know you do it. YouTube warrior. Oh my god! You know you. I don't care what you say. I don't do it. You don't? No. Are you kidding me? No, I don't. I've told you this before. Ninety-nine percent of people. <laughs> I'm a one percenter. Or Kip's a liar. No, Occam's no. Razor says Kip's a lager. 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 L- I'm a lager. beer. <laughs> Jackass. I thought there's a lager. Lager. That's a lager. It's called a lager. It's not a lager. No. How's it spelled? It's spelled like lager. It is not. It's a lager. God, I suck at life. A little bit. Uh, well. <laughs> so, what was it again? It was, uh, but I know I don't. I, I did, and then I realized, wow, this is way above my skill level. Uh, yeah. And oh, I stopped because I kept like, hey, I'm gonna try this flying arm bar. Yeah, it's, it's hard to find a YouTube video <laughs> on like basic jujitsu because that's not fun. No, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> Here's my tutorial on flying arm bar. Yeah, exactly. Get ready. <laughs> you got this flying white belt. arm bar. They defend that straight in Oma Plata. They defend <laughs> that go go Plata from your back. <laughs> if they do that, they punch them in the nose. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, I do get that a lot. Everybody's like, saw this on YouTube. Let me try it. Yeah. Yeah, let's not work on the stuff that the coach is teaching us. <laughs> no. That we're practicing. Let's work on the shit that we've seen on YouTube once. And it worked because, for this guy. Because you know it was one time because they go down the rabbit hole. Like you go video and then you think to yourself, I got that. 
Oh, I yeah, can do yeah. That. It's I, fucking I, like three I steps. Saw, I saw it once. I might have even rewound it. <laughs> they might have explained it two or three times. Clearly. <laughs> Clearly, Clearly, I'm an expert. I'm going to pull this off on the first <laughs> roll of the night. Who <clears throat> doesn't? Exactly. <laughs> nope. Well, I do that. Yeah, I know. You did it today. I did. Hanging out in my house and you're like watching your phone and then you just look up at me. I want to can try I try arm? <laughs> <laughs> just can I try like a arm lock that I just learned, <laughs> and <laughs> just learned by just pausing the video? Yes, I did. <laughs> didn't even get through the whole video. But to be to be fair, at least I didn't do it at class. Is that is that? Uh, yeah, that's uh, a respectful bo- bonus. It's more respect. Yeah, uh, I like it. Yeah. So to be fair, you should uh, you should practice the stuff that your coach teaches you. Hell yes. In my opinion. We're trying to get better yeah. at that. I'm <laughs> such a hypocrite. <laughs> you are. <laughs> well, you know, the thing is, is I really like jujitsu, and I really like jujitsu videos. Like, they, they they make me smile, and I like watching As do new I. stuff. Yeah. As do I. Uh, I can't. I can't because I started. <laughs> yeah. I, I did land a, a jujitsu YouTube move on somebody. It was called the Spicy Tuna Roll. You were so proud of your damn I, self. I, I can't tell you how proud I Have was. Have you used it since? No. Yeah, I used it. Ooh, I used productive. it. I, I landed it twice, I think. Yes, and then I never used it again. Never even tried. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness you tried it. Way yeah. to use that in your I'm, arsenal. Yeah. Th- to be fair, I'm trying to take Chad's advice and and uh, expand my mind and try other stuff, but it's so hard. L- the first thing I ever landed was side control to north south, Kimura grip. They defended <laughs> the Kimura armbar. That's the first thing I've ever landed in jujitsu. And you keep doing it. And that's literally just about the only thing I ever use, unless you blatantly give me something else. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. So like I'm, when I was, when I, when we first started, I would just leave every limb yeah, <laughs> in the yeah, wrong place. Yeah. yeah. If you have no idea what you're doing and you're just giving me like gift wrapped, here's my arm, here's my <laughs> neck. I'm going to turn my back into you. I'm like, I guess I'll do this now. <laughs> but yeah. I guess I can break out this yeah. skill. So I've, I've been trying so hard not to do that but it's just that's all i see you know you know you get you, but you have different setups it's not that bad yeah I'm, I, you I, do I'm, you have different setups you get people to give it to you in different ways yeah. with I'm, those setups it's i'm trying fun, i'm know? trying to branch out i don't have a problem with it yeah well thank you keep building keep building all right anyways what's my next stereotype i want <gasps> suffocator suffocator oh, we, kind of, we, t- we kind of talked about the suffocator just a minute ago about <laughs> yes, hey we did. hey I- i'm a large dude and i'm better than you i'm just gonna lay on top of you with all my weight yeah, it, and not move. <laughs> it's like I'm not going to try anything because that would indicate that I have to like take my weight off. Yes, and I will not do that. Yes, <laughs> taking my weight off is losing. <laughs> if I have a dominant position, I will not lose it. I will hold this yeah. until the bell rings. <laughs> exactly, because if I'm in a dominant position, clearly I have two points. <laughs> clearly, I'm gonna keep those two points. <laughs> Never give them back. Oh, it's so great. Oh, man. Oh. I've, I've had it before. You, you get a guy just smashing you, and then you stay there. And you kind of, like, loosen up, like, please, like, transition. Yeah, I had Please a, yeah. transition into something other than this, because it hurts. <laughs> I, I want guy. you to do something. Yeah. I want you to submit me, but they won't. No, I, get, uh, I was rolling with, uh, was it Josh from his from Corollary School? Hmm. He, he oh, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he yeah. wasn't the doing... Guy was just there. He wasn't doing that. Like, he wasn't just sitting. He awesome blue belt. He's really skilled. It was just hilarious because he got me in such a bad position. I'm like, please tap me. <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue what the fuck to do. Please God damn exactly. it. So it's, it fits. Yeah. It fits. Yeah, when when, uh, when somebody's got like a good uh, a good mount, like a good solid mount, and, yes. they're, and they're, they're going from position to position, you know, kind of setting up the arm bar, and you can't wait till they finish the arm bar. <laughs> no more pressure. That's cool. That's cool. I'm fine with that. But if they're just like grinding their hips into you and not moving, they're or, not they're not attempting to actually do a said move. Like, or, I'm okay with the or pressure. They, or they just hold onto your head and push their gi into your face. Oh, yeah, hot box you. And you're just like... <gasps> you're, just, you're just sniffing their armpit I, for like I am minutes. breathing your essence. Please, God, stop. <laughs> and it's at that point where I don't mind the smells like Play-Doh guy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, as long as my face is going to be all up in your armpit, it smell like Play-Doh. Yeah, oh, fries, yeah, it's much better, better than sweat. Better than my sweat. Yeah, I'll give you Man that. Man musk. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Yeah, get some Calvin Klein going. I'm, I'm fine. Yeah, Shoot. good. Yeah, soak it up. What's my next one? I want another one. Oh, you want another? We're not done with that one. I'm done because I'm moving on. Oh, okay. I want to say Hulk Smash guy, but the Coach Tap guy is right after that. I kind of want the Coach mm. Tap guy. Coach Tap guy. Explain. Co- the Coach Tap is when 
you're you're whooping that ass. <laughs> like you're clearly winning. <laughs> and I get it. You know, I'm not a black belt. I'm no I'm no Croiler or Morgan, even better. But uh <clears throat> <laughs> well played, well placed, I, Morgan I tried, I tried. slash Croiler kicking nuts. That was well played. I tried to just move on it like it never happened, but it's I failed. And I started sweating again. <laughs> you did? Like pause. Oh you shit! I did it. Started to beat up on my forehead. Uh, so uh, I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> Coach Tab guy, you were explaining. Coach like, Tab guy, like I get it. My my technique might not be superb. But I'm still going to tap that ass out. Just before I do, <laughs> you're going to explain to me how I should do it more right. Like, like, do you not understand that you are losing? But that I'm winning. I'm do. winning with shit technique. <laughs> so maybe you should shut your face. Don't like, show me how to do it better exactly. if you can't stop I it. I just beat you rolling like an asshole. So <laughs> tell me how to do it better. That's so bad. <laughs> It's also that that one kind of coincides with another one we had down, which is uh, I was waiting you <laughs> for you to get that guy. I was waiting for you to do that. Like yeah, you you, you, know, you pull out the sneaky move. You're like you you bait him into something, and bam, you got it. You're proud of yourself. And or, like, yeah. yeah, I was waiting for you to do that. Seeing if you saw it. Yeah, I had like, a oh shit! <laughs> I don't even I... care if you were. <laughs> you don't or, say that. Or the guy that's on mount and gets swept, and they're like. Psst, I was waiting for you to do yeah, that. Just seeing if you see the opening. Then you like you, you motherfucker. You were on mount, bro. Yeah, like, don't, mount. <laughs> don't steal my joy. You took my moment. You, my moment of glory. Yeah, I had this little sparkling joy, yeah. and you're like, no, I'm gonna crush that shit. <laughs> I, worked, I was waiting for you to do I that. I worked so hard for that, <laughs> and you <laughs> stole it from me. Uh, yeah, I was waiting for that, bro. Like, yeah, uh, yeah, you like that? I gave it to you. Here's my <laughs> gift. <laughs> the best thing is for me on these stereotypes. We have a few more. Is everyone's gonna think I'm talking about them because I've only rolled it hard. <laughs> I'm like, shit. No, to be to be clear, I've talked about these from other gyms that I've yes, yeah, and, and, I've, yeah. and this is some shit that I've done. Like I'm, yeah, oh yeah, I'm I've done, my, I've done I, most of these. Yeah, I'm throwing myself <laughs> under the bus because I've been there. Go, yeah, who's waiting for that? You know, yeah, exactly. I was I was that new white belt douchebag that thought I was gonna be way better than I end up being. Oh, yeah. I oh, did yeah. the exact same thing. I'm like, oh, I totally waited for that. I suck. My my <laughs> ego was more swole than I was when I was jacked. <laughs> it was terrible. Wildly incorrect. Uh, yeah. Wild. Was, yeah, it was awful. So everyone at the gym, I love you all. Except Ed. Ed, son you of a bitch. son of a <laughs> bitch. <laughs> you non gee bringing motherfucker. <laughs> so much fun. <laughs> I'm totally posting a picture of him. <laughs> <laughs> This is that son of a bitch. That's the uh, meme that's right, right there. <laughs> this is this, this is the, is the face guy. of a son of a bitch. Uh, is, he's like the nicest looking guy <laughs> he ever. Is too. He he looks like Marcelo Garcia, just like the nicest guy. Like Smiles just a nice all smiling, the time. Just super sweet guy. Oh, we're so yeah, 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 fuck you. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's another one? Uh, oh, here's me as well. The sound here's effect. Me as well. The sound effects guy. <laughs> like, I don't know why I do it. But, you know, like, if I'm doing something in slow motion, I'm like... For some reason, you turn yeah. into Friday the 13th. Yeah. Uh, hell, man, I'll even start, like, singing songs. Just you do that shit. Dumbest, it's so freaking not, not annoying. Not just songs, like the dumbest... Oh, yeah, horrible. Dumbest songs, like, uh... No, I'm not going to do it. No, <laughs> please stop, please. I, I, I remember Paul once did Will the... Will always can't, can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> he did the... I'll fly away, and then I don't know what the song was, but he was on top of me doing the Titanic. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, I was too. My arms spread. <laughs> I'm, er, I'm sailing. From what about Bob? Yeah, that was it. I was like, you asshole. You were carrying all my weight, yeah. and I'm flying like an airplane. <laughs> this is fun. I can't get you off. You're like, hey, Dick, I'm going to move your hips, bro. Until then, I'm flying. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, asshole. So, yeah, he's definitely... And then you have the sound effects person that enjoys it so much that they, like, giggle and squeal. Oh, yeah. Mel, I'm talking about you. Talking, looking at you, Mel. I did the, I did a sweep just trying to show her some things, and I got her pretty airborne, but, like, no, I let her down right. nicely. And she goes, wee! <laughs> And I just started laughing. Nice. <laughs> I didn't even go. I didn't even like move forward in the move. I just did it and started laughing with her. <laughs> so gotta love it. Nice. Moving on. Yes. Moving on. There's a couple that applied to me. Uh, one, the flapper. 
<laughs> you were so annoying with that. Uh, well, I did it to <clears throat> Ed, talking about you again. <laughs> you non deep bringing motherfucker. That's popular today. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> this is the best thing about having a podcast. Like, oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk about you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's more like... <laughs> Talked about you last week. You're right. Uh, listen, get ready for that shit. Yeah. It's a good way to get people to listen to the podcast. Hey, uh, mentioned your name. <laughs> One more download. <laughs> Guaranteed. <laughs> Boom. Taking it. Uh, oh, we got to talk about our download things at the end of the show. Don't let me Yeah, we will. Yeah, yeah, we will get but, to uh, it. But yeah, the flopper. So Ed didn't bring a gi, as we mentioned a couple times. I didn't know what to grab, so I would just lay down in front of him. <laughs> Which would then make him mad. Like, no, you got to try. I'm like, I can't get you. <laughs> I don't know what to do, so I'm going to flop in front of you until you get on top of me, and then I can grab something. Like yeah. I can get, I can work. There's from a body there. part close to me, <laughs> but I can't. I can't just like get a hold of you, you slippery fish. <laughs> so, but yeah, apparently I, I make a couple people mad doing that, where I just kind of like roll underneath them and let them. You know, they don't feel good about doing. Yeah, you any, play. You play kitten. Yeah, it's really freaking yeah, annoying. Yeah, I kind of have my hands and feet up in the air and I let them. You know. Yeah. Because I, I was I was trying to be that guy I was explaining earlier, like, hey, let people do stuff. But maybe don't make it look so obvious. Yeah, it's like, like, don't it, be a dick about yeah, it. Like yeah, you're me. literally like, yeah. you suck this yeah. bad. Yeah. Watch me lay down yeah, and give you my back. You <laughs> suck so bad. I'm just going to like turn around and walk backwards up to you. <laughs> <laughs> then he's purring. It's all fucking yeah. awkward. Yeah. It, go, it goes from kind of being helpful to condescending. <laughs> Very <laughs> quick. quick. <laughs> all right, what else we got? Uh, oh, uh, this apparently applies to me. The I suck at this guy. That also applies to me. Uh, yeah. Mine's true, though. Yeah, my, uh, I was rolling with Dan, and the first 30 seconds he goes, with all your self-deprecating humor, Paul, I forget how good you actually are. <laughs> that actually made me feel special, I'm not going to lie. Up. My head swelled a few sizes. <laughs> like, aw, that was the nicest thing anybody's ever said to me. Kip's never yeah. said anything close to that nice yeah, to me. Yeah. Sorry about your luck, Ed, but I kind of love Dan right now. <laughs> so nothing D- bad to say about yeah, Dan. Did I mention he brought his gi? I'm just throwing He that brings out it every time. every time. Ed. <laughs> Not so much. You son of a bitch. Uh, all right, last one. Last <laughs> one more. One. The butthurt guy. <laughs> yeah, what do you say about that? Like the guy that just gets pissed every time he loses. Or even just doesn't do a like a transition right. They yeah. like get angry. <laughs> it's like it's like the time where I got butthurt that I couldn't pass your mother knee shield. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm butthurt now because... <laughs> I'm clearly better than you, and this didn't work. Now I'm mad about stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and I clearly get all butt hurt like every time I roll Chad. I'm just like, I suck so bad. You know the sucky thing about rolling with your coach is he's better than me. No, light years. no, no, no. <laughs> that's fine. Like, oh, I'm, that's I'm, good. Like I'm fine. Like well, I mean Jesse and Justin, light years better than me, but I roll yes. better with them. Because I don't get in my own head. Oh, I get like, all up in my head. Yeah, I can I can just roll with them hard and and lose and get beat and you know I understand that, but it's a it's a better roll I think than when I roll with Chad because with, with Chad, for some reason I'm trying to prove myself. I guess. and I don't know why I do that. Like just Cause roll because it, it goes clearly the other way. Oh yeah, when you try to prove it, you end up botarded. You're just like oh. Yeah. So if you've never if you've never <laughs> experienced this, oh, put, put your shoes on. And tie it as fast as you possibly can, <laughs> and see how well that goes for you. Yeah. Same feeling. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Oh, look, it's my shoes aren't tied. Yeah. yeah. Guess what? That's your, how you roll. <laughs> exactly. Oh, yeah, just do, I did yeah. nothing right. Yeah, do something as hard and fast as possible, and you're gonna fuck it up. And that's what I do <laughs> when I roll with Coach. Well, and, <laughs> how does Croiler feel? Like he's got to get that times ten. Like, uh, yeah, because he rolls with. All like he always starts with the newer people yeah. or the people I haven't rolled with him. Yeah, yeah that's just got to be like because you're you're <laughs> Croiler fucking Gracie for Christ's sake. You know, people. You know, you got this like little little god image, like demi god. People you don't they don't know what to do. It's called him a demi god. Demi god. I, I call him that on. <laughs> oh, the podcast you're gonna hear next. Oh yeah, you. I did, did again. <laughs> yeah, did yeah. He's my man crush. Back the yeah, fuck yeah, off. All right, my bad. My bad. Well, he hates me now. He's gonna have. <laughs> He's this. going to now. Oh shit! I'm dead. <laughs> We should wrap this up <laughs> before I stick my foot in my mouth any further. Just keeps getting deeper. Yeah, I'm trying to be funny, it's failing. <laughs> like that wasn't funny. That was just disrespectful. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Yeah, uh, uh, for you. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I talked shit earlier. Oh right, when right. with Chad, gotcha. I got that shit out of the way. That's right. Oh, you still need a uh, a beatdown and a foot race with Chad. Stop with the foot race, dude. I'm oh, gonna no. fall on my face. Dude, it's gonna happen. It's I don't happen. have the knees for it. 
I'm just making any excuse I can. I didn't need a Snickers. Uh, <laughs> it's going to happen. Mm, I have emphysema. Uh, <laughs> we have a brand new YouTube channel. Oh. We have our first video up there, and our Please. second one will be a view fault racing chat. <laughs> Please, God, no. Oh, it's going to happen. I'm just going to walk. No, nah, you have to run. I have to run. Don't I'm be that guy. I'm yeah. competitive. I can't. It, what, what, I, he's going to whoop me, though. He's all in <gasps> shape. I am not. What if you won? I mean, I'm quick. I used to be quick. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, <laughs> hold on. I used to be fast. Probably not yeah. anymore. I guess we're going to find out. All right, before we go. So we changed. Uh, you talk about that. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Well, no, then we changed the way that iTunes got our podcast. Pretty much it. It's not called an RSS feed. Really simple syndication. So it's the way our our podcast gets out there. Gets out to iTunes, gets right. out to Stitcher, gets out to... It's going to be on Google Play, too. Yeah, we started um, on... Episode 10 what? and 11. Yeah. Yeah, and then 12, What's obviously. the website we use? Uh, it's called Buzzsprout. No, no, no. The one be, uh, that our website's on. Squarespace. Squarespace. Yeah. And we had to move off of it. It was stupid <clears throat> and didn't help me. Yeah. So I blame the website. So, yeah, so originally, all our <laughs> downloads were going through Squarespace, which yes. is not set up for a podcast, and we didn't know because well, we don't we don't know we're anything. New. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're figuring this stuff out literally as we go. Yes. So so half or at least probably a lot of our subscribers go through that. Yes, it, so, it seems to. It's it's stuck on an old subs- yeah. like an old feed from us. So I think that's going to. Affect them getting more stuff, right? Which is worrying me because yeah. we're wonderful and everyone needs to hear it, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't <laughs> want to let people know like, oh, they quit because you might. I don't know if you're going to see our new stuff. Yeah. So, um, in it, we may just be guessing. Yeah, but, we don't but, know what we're talking about. Right but now. I did grab somebody's phone to help them because they asked me like, how the heck do I find it? Right. I found episode six. <laughs> I was yeah. like, oh, okay, and I looked and it was jumbled up the. The f- different numbers were in different places. It wasn't in the correct order. Oh, no. I'm like, uh, that's weird. And I look, and the picture's the wrong color. No, we screwed I'm like, something it's the old yeah. pink one. Yeah. I'm like, that's not right. It's red now. So just if you want to, we would appreciate it because we don't want you to miss anything right. of this wonderfulness. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this is a shit show. Yeah, this but, is, I love this yeah. show. And uh, just unsubscribe, delete it out of there, resubscribe. Um, then you'll make sure you get all the new stuff. Yeah, you get yeah. all the new stuff. Um, I'll give you a hug. Uh, just come see me. Hey, and while you're doing all that, you could possibly leave a five star review. We have some. We do. We have ten. Holy we crap! We have ten, and we have five reviews. Yeah, one's anonymous, and it's a really good one. So thank you, thank everybody, you so much for, for listening. listening. Yeah, for reviewing, for listening, for giving us a shot, for telling your friends. Yeah, we love it. We yeah, love doing this. The biggest compliment you can give us is telling your friends, thank you so much. Yeah, and just listen. Have fun. And Croiler, as much shit as I talk about you, for <laughs> thank you. <laughs> oh, I was going to say, where are you going with yeah, us? Thank you for uh, shouting us out. It's been awesome. I, yeah, am, I am grateful and humbled. That was fantastic. Yeah, he's a great guy and uh, not a demigod, but uh, is quite but a, wonderful. But a legit god. <laughs> <laughs> he's the god of wrist locks. <laughs> so I felt... Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. so I've seen and felt and yeah. cried about. Yeah, so. as everybody else. Yes. But, uh, yeah, he's wonderful. But uh, please just, you know, get on the right feed. If you want to <coughs> look at it, you can also check out uh, Buzzsprout. It's actually uh, the website it directly. It's thedads.buzzsprout.com. And it'll take you right to our feed. So you can't miss it there. Um, and Stitcher, just search Grappling Dads. And iTunes, obviously. Yes. iTunes, iTunes is the easiest. It is. I don't understand people that don't buy an iPhone. I, really <laughs> I don't understand these people. It's so easy. It is, but, <clears throat> oh, man, Androids do some cool-ass shit. Yeah, but I don't know how to do it, so it's yeah. worthless Yeah, it's pointless for you to have it. So, and I just do it because I'm a simpleton at this point. Uh, right, I yeah. got sick of cell phones, but yeah. after selling them for five yeah. years. If a phone comes with, like, directions, it's already over my head. Like it's, yeah. <laughs> I might as well not get that. You one. have to do this. Ooh, yeah. it's got to be really self-explanatory. <laughs> it can have options. Yeah. Don't give me options. I need, I need to be able to ask my phone how to do something, and then I'm good. Yeah, you're good. Well, you can do that with Google. Yeah. Oh, also, uh, we are on YouTube now, right? Yes. We have one video on YouTube. Yep, it's a fun dads. video. Check it out. Yep. Uh, the for some reason the um the tag on it's all messed up. Yeah, but, we gotta yeah. fix that. But we're out there. Uh, Instagram, I think we're funny. 
<laughs> I try really hard to have funny pictures. As do I. <clears throat> Working on our meme game. Yes, if and you want to see our children in stupid memes, oh, yeah. us in stupid memes, check it yeah, out. Check it out. And uh, Facebook. We try there. Definitely check out Facebook because yeah. uh, most of our videos that we find interesting, like the slamming video is on there, the bullying video is on there, the Gracie video you posted. Well, a lot of the uh, articles that we talk about. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We, we, um, easier, we share them. Yeah. The easiest way to share them is yeah. via Facebook. Yeah. The, so, the, uh, the, um, well, way to yeah. go. <laughs> uh, way uh, to explain. The, uh, crap. What are you even trying to go uh, with? What we talked about earlier. Did you two times? Okay. Essay? <laughs> Where the hell are you? I, even, I love how you're looking at me like I should know I am. what you're saying. I am. I'm trying to look at my notes and I don't yeah, have no, it you written got down. Absolutely God, nothing. This really sucks, man. I just... <laughs> Oh See, God. this is why I need my sleep, Kip. This is you mock me for go. Oh, you gotta go to bed. Yeah, because if I don't, this is what happens. <laughs> this, this I lose my mind. <laughs> I'm a simple man that needs to sleep. Okay, so basically, uh, what it comes down to we get great articles from articles, places. That's like, the word. Yes, articles. it is. <laughs> <laughs> you could have just said that. I know I could have, but that you just let me drown. You just let me drown. Oh, you, you animal. <laughs> Uh, it's so much more fun to do that, hey, though. Hey, Ed, I like you more than I like Kit. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> that's fair enough. Yeah, you're that's still, fair you're enough. still a dick that didn't bring his ski, though. I just want to throw that out. Yeah, asshole. Uh, I wasn't even there on this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, I think I got, we're going to yeah. call it. Sounds good. See ya. Bye.